Hi, Nancy Chapin here with Windermere Mount Baker. Hey, I want to just take a second to tell you why when I'm working with buyers, I love working in a seller's market. Wait a minute, Nancy, that seems crazy. Why would a buyer want to be buying in a seller's market instead of a buyer's market? And here, let me tell you why. By very definition, when you're looking in a buyer's market, it's because of the supply and demand balance that there are way more houses than there are buyers. So yes, the good news is you get a lot more inventory to select from. You probably have a lot more um, leveraging negotiation room with a seller because they're a lot more desperate because there's more of them than there are buyers. But the very definition is that because of that supply and demand, it's a depreciating market values are going down. So it means that what you're paying for your house today, three, six, 12 months from now, probably maybe not 12 months, three to six months from now, it's very possible your house is actually gonna be going down in value. Most people are not very comfortable buying in that market. The other thing people tend to do is they, so they wait and try and time the bottom of the market. But the reality is, again, by definition, the, mostly the way we know we've hit the bottom of the market is because we bounce back up again. So, and then you have the bounce and then there's a lot of frenzy because everybody's trying to get cl as close to the bottom as they can and that com competition can change very quickly. Here's what I like about a seller's market is, yes, it's competitive. Yes, it can be heartbreaking and frustrating and lots of other variables that are playing in, um, in a seller's market. But here's what's awesome is what you pay for your house today is almost immediately going up in value three, six, 12 months from when you buy it. It is that instant equity. So when you are needing to stretch a little bit to be a little more competitive, to get to be that winning offer and a multiple offer, it's worth it. If you're looking at an investment in terms of years, especially a decade or more, going that extra bit is critical because it really is gonna be worth that. So often I hear people talk about, I don't wanna overpay for a house. Well, when it's an appreciating market, you're gonna catch up that bit and it's gonna mean actually getting the house that you want rather than not and ultimately paying a higher value because in fact, prices are appreciating. So if you wanna talk more about why I think it's a great time to buy a house in a seller's market, give me a call. Take care, bye-bye.